What is going on today? What is going on? What is going on everybody? Today is going to be a great day. We're going to be using the app called Netfish. It is 100% free. No subscription needed. I'm, I'm like I'm being 100% honest with you. It's not one of those kind of things where you got to download it and then pay a subscription afterward. It is a fishing app that is 100% free i'm telling you right now you guys need to download it like it'll be down in the description click on it download it you'll get new free fishing spots i'm gonna show you guys right now look how easy this is to find new fishing spots I had to walk over in the shade for you guys but see check this out look at this oh there's avery right there what's going on avery loading loading here it goes all right home screen right here you go ahead and you click on this up here fishing nearby all right so you got the lake right here of course you're going to click on it it's going to tell you what's inside the lake it's got everything pumpkin seed channel cat common carp catfish you guys know the deal all right now here's a really 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 good part it tells you where to fish so you come here all right so you're in this area it's going to give you fishing hot spots look at where i'm standing right now I'm standing on what this, this app says is a fishing hotspot. It tells you what time of the day to do it, best time to fish, good times to fish, some morning, sunrise, all that kind of good stuff, and how to fish that area. I mean, come on now, why wouldn't you want to give that a shot? So, give it a shot for yourself. Go into the description, click on it. Give it a shot. You guys never know. There could be spots in your area that you, you had no idea were even fishable. Give it a shot, download it, let me know how you guys do. It's our time, boys. I've been here for about an hour. No success whatsoever. We're going up and down that creek. I've seen them. These fish are being super skittish. So I'm gonna try to make this float. That's my entire goal right here, is just to get it out there, let it float, and see if we can catch one of these on top water bread. I know for a fact if I stand up, they'll, they'll spook off and they won't come even near here. That's why I'm sitting down right now. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, has he got it? Has he got it? He took my bread, he took it, he took it. Does he have it? Oh my gosh, he took everything off of it. Dang it. This is gonna happen. I think I gotta get my, I think I gotta get a piece out there. I think I'm too close to the shore. Got them roll way out there. Those are big ones. Okay, there we go. Come on. Oh, got him. Oh my gosh, got him. That's a good one. That's a good one. Oh my God, that's a good one. Oh my gosh. Come on, come on. Told you guys we just had to get it out there. Oh my gosh, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Turn your head, turn your head, turn your head. That is a big fish, ladies and gentlemen. Come on. Oh my gosh, come on now. Stop doing this to me. Get around this rock, get around this rock. I'm like shaking right now just because I've been trying so hard to get him to eat. And I finally got him fired up and we got a good one on for the first one. That is a big fish right there. Come on. Stop, 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 stop. Come on. Calm down, calm down, dude. We're good, we're good. Oh, I need my bag. Just calm down right there. Don't move, little dude. I'm gonna keep pressure so you don't move. One thing I learned with fishing for these things, you must have a set of these on you at all times. All right, he's free. You're free, dude. You're free. You're free to do carp things. Nothing like catching carp on top water, huh? Look at him still rolling out there. I don't know, I, I enjoy this. I'm telling you guys, you guys need to give it a shot. If you guys have not done this yet, seriously, go do it. Go out there, go carp fishing, it's fun. I know a lot of you guys are bass fishermen that are on this channel, but just give something else a shot. I never thought I would like carp, but I actually do. It's really fun to catch. It's really fun to catch them. Get them all fired up. All right, I got a mess going on over here. I got a bobber all spread out. Big thing is, I don't know if I'll be able to get them to eat again after I just caught that one right here. So I'm gonna toss some more of this uh, good old fashioned Wonder Bread out there and see if it'll do the do the trick. Ugh, what is that? He's coming forward, he's coming forward, he's coming forward. Oh, he just nibbled on it. There's two of them. Come on, he's coming back for it, he's coming back for it. Oh, he keeps nibbling on it. You see him nibbling on it? Come on, come on. The one behind him is big. Stop being a pansy, just take it. I'm like, like seriously guys, I'm like leaning back right now on my bag, like almost laying down so they can't see me in my shadow. Oh, stop being a pansy. I can just barely see its mouth sucking on that bread. It's like these fish know there's something up with that piece and they're just not even messing with it. Got him, got him, yep, got him. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Finally, 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 oh wow. Come on, stay pinned, stay pinned, stay pinned. This one could be bigger than the last one. Dude, tell me this is the big one. Tell me this is the big one. Please be the big one. <laughs> Dude, look at the control I have with it. <laughs> look at this rod. Look at this rod completely just keeled over right now. This is a good one. I think this one's bigger than the last one for sure. Or this one's just extraordinarily pissed. Oh, prep, check, got him. Put him in my pocket just in case. Oh, don't break off, don't break off. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look how powerful these fish are. You guys are crazy not to go out and give it a shot. 
I'll take him. Don't freak out. Don't freak out, dude. Don't you freak out. Oh, he's about to come loose. I'm about to get you loose. You're about to be free. There you go. You're good, dude. You're good, little man. I know you guys are probably soaking wet, but there he goes. Go down to the description right now. Click on the link. Download the app. See if there's any kind of fishing area like this around you. You guys have not touched yet. Now let's see if we can uh, see what we got inside our little box. I gotta get all this. Let me look at all that gunk on there. He dug me into the freaking nastiness. Interested in doing this, this kind of fishing, but this is pretty much what I've been using. These are size 10 trebles, braid to make sure it floats. And that's pretty much it. You, all you want that thing to do is float. I don't know if I, uh, I'm pretty positive I didn't make this up, but I didn't see anybody else doing it like this, but that's how I'm fishing it right now. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and throw, you guys think I should throw something, let's see, how about, come on, get off of this. How about something like that? Let's throw this around just for a little bit and see if we can get connected on something else. I also just realized by giving you guys access to that app and searching me, that means you guys are gonna have access to a few of my uh, my secret fishing spots that are probably not gonna be secret anymore, huh? Oh my gosh, did I just happen? That did just happen. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of uh, Walkers TV. Oh, yep. This happened. Well, let's go ahead and get a time check. What do we got? 5.52. I'll go ahead and fish for another eight minutes or so, and then we gotta get home and hang out with Avery and Sarah and kind of start getting prepped for this trip. So when you guys are throwing a score bell, make sure you guys get it to do the twisty motion on top of the water. That's how you get the most bites. I mean, look at that. That action cannot be beat. That's, that's good. That's real good. All right, boys and girls, last cast. Here we go. So I guess if you guys live in the DFW area and you guys want somewhere to fish with your, your child, maybe come to this spot. Pretty much have given it away and you know you can catch some fish and put them on them. Let's go see Avery and Sarah. What is this? It's a dog proof trap. The owner's son is like a really, really, really good at trapping and he sent me a, uh, a raccoon trap, dog proof trap. I'm pretty positive what it is. Thank you for sending this for me. Cool. We had something else on the door. We gotta grab. Now that I got one of these, I know a thousand of you guys have been telling me I needed to have one of these anyway, so now we got one, we're gonna set that up. Oh, this is from a trip. Should I open it up or should I leave it in there? Mm, let's open it up. So I want you guys to have somewhat of an understanding of what I'm gonna be going targeting. This thing is in 2.25 meters. Look at that, 2.25 meters, line max 200 pounds, and it's made in Korea, I guess. Cow big game popping special. Oh yeah, look at this freaking thing. I'm gonna be 100% honest with you, that rod costs as much as, I think, four of mine, four or five of mine. And I had to buy one for this trip because I don't have the tackle for what I'm targeting. I hate to say it. What are you doing, Avery? Whoa! It's a fishing pole. Whoa! That's so crazy, right? Come on, let's go. So, we got this for that rod. I'm gonna tell you guys right now, I, I could not afford this entire setup. I did buy the rod like I told you guys in yesterday's video. I did not buy the Stella. The Stella, this thing is worth, let's just, let's just put this in perspective right here. I'm going after one fish. I'm going to be targeting one kind of fish that it takes this big of a reel and that big of a style rod. So let's start, let's start churning those comments. I want to figure out where you guys think I'm going. Because I'm, I'm actually, this is, I'm very, very excited for this trip. Just like you! Woo! We're going to have Sarah hold the camera so you guys can have an actual perspective. She knows when the camera's on. So you guys can have an actual perspective. Do you see, can you fully see the size of this thing? Uh, is it tough? Yeah. Do you guys see this thing? I don't have the handle put on the saddle. Oh my gosh, it is crazy. Look at this thing. Look at the bottom half right here. I'm talking, look at the power we're gonna have to have to use. Oh. Look, does it make me look more manly? What? Does it make me look more manly? Having a big rod in my hand? It looks really weird that it's in your crotch. But. <laughs> hey. It's a big fishing pole. You want to hold it? Here. Here you go. Thank you. Yes, you're welcome. Yeah. 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 
Uh, okay, my bad. If I kind of didn't seem like I was normal today, because I, I don't know, ever since I came back from Colorado and talked with my buddy, my, my anxiety level has been through the freaking roof. I've done nothing but like think about Afghanistan and all that kind of stuff, but it's all good. I just ran it out of me. We're good to go. Sometimes that happens. That's why I may have seen a little bit off today. But I decided to let you guys know. That's the reasoning. But we're good. We hit it with a four and a half mile run, knocked it out of me. Now we're good. Now, now we gotta go shower. Ain't that right, buddy boy? Oh gosh, I'm gonna be honest with you. Avery is in a very, very, very bad mood. You guys wanna know why? You guys wanna know why? Bubbles. Bubbles. This bubble wand is causing us a lot of pain right now. <laughs> She's running around <laughs> screaming bloody murder because she just can't have her bubble wand. It's time for bed. You don't need your bubble wand, Avery. What are you doing? I hope she sees this 16 years from now and be like, what was I thinking about my bubble wand? Are you good now? Hey. Hey. She's good? It's that time, Avery. Night night. Bottle in the face. We need this, we need this, we need this, boys. We need this, we need this, we need this. Oh, Avery Rose, what are you doing? I'm gonna say this right now, I'm real sorry about today. If it wasn't as exciting, enthusiastic as normal, like I told you guys earlier, my, my mind was not, not, it wasn't all there since, since I came back, but we're good, we're good to go now. Tomorrow's gonna to be back to the same normal thing, positive mental attitude. I try, I have to preach it to myself when I wake up. You guys know the deal, you guys know the deal. I love every single one of you. Thank you for sticking by me during well, life in general, pretty much. So if you guys, <laughs> so, whoa, here we go, we're back to get into it. Click on that video right there if you guys have not seen that one. Click that one down below if you have not already, and make sure to subscribe down below. Other than that, I love every single one of you. Thanks for hanging out with me, and I'm about to disappear right now.